I write a letter when I have a crush so intense that I don't know what else to do. Rereading my letters reminds me of how powerful my emotions can be, how all-consuming. People don't really write letters. If they do, they're a keeper. Hi, my name is Talia, and I'm a junior, and I go to Cardinal Spellman. Hi, my name is Nasir Chasse. I'm a senior, and I go to Eagle Academy for Young Men. And we are here to critique movies about high school. Let's start. You're all of age. Oh, yeah. Who the hell is Jesus H. Garcia? It's Jesus. It's your new identity. Tell me that picture doesn't look like you. I can't even think of myself actually like trying to get a fake ID because there's so many there's so many parties out there. Like there's like a lot of parties as for 16 year olds and older like I wouldn't even try to get a fake ID. Like I'm gonna just get like in trouble. I get caught up. Like I'm always getting caught. Nowadays in high school, students definitely don't need a fake ID to get into parties. Dion, you're up. Oh no, Miss Stoger. I have a note from my tennis instructor, and he would prefer it if I didn't expose myself to any training that might derail his teachings. Fine. Amber? Miss Stoger, my plastic surgeon doesn't want me doing any activity where balls fly at my nose. I definitely try to get out of gym class because it's really annoying because I go to school with stockings, and then when you're in gym, if you don't change your stockings into like knee highs, that's like five points off your grade. Well, in my school, they, they're bold. Like, they would sit there and say, I'm not getting dressed, even though they have their clothes. Their excuses are a little too far-fetched. Like, I would probably be like, I don't have my gym clothes with me today, or something like that. Missy, is it? Okay, before we start, I'm afraid we're going to need to make sure you can do a standing back tuck. Standard procedure, you understand. Standing back handspring back tuck, okay? My freshman year, I was auditioning for STEP. As I was, I was a little intimidating at first because, you know, they're seniors and I was a freshman. But it was definitely not like how in the clip was, like, not that mean. If that was, like, to ever happen, you would get kicked out. I transferred from Los Angeles. Your school has no gymnastics team. This is a last resort. You gotta be, like, polite, even though you may feel like you're better than someone. You just have to be humble. You gotta humble yourself. Anderson? Anderson? Here! Bueller? 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 <laughs> For him to go over the name like over, five over, times right. and no one answered, I mean, I was Clearly. I would assume someone is absent. Like. <laughs> exactly. If we have like a regular teacher, they usually don't take attendance because they already know the students, but like if it's like substitutes, like they definitely go through the list. They would just mark the names down, like they wouldn't call it out. This clip definitely is 50-50 of like how it is in high school now. And how they take the attendance. Even though I have the alarm clock, like I'll still like turn it off even though it went off. And I'm like, all right, five extra minutes. And it turns into 10 and it turns to 15. And I'm just like, okay, I'm late. My mom doesn't pull me by my feet. It's either I get up or she's gonna make me get up. Like she screams at me to get up. When I wake up, my mom usually is still sleeping. So usually I have to wake her up. So yeah, I don't really can relate to the clip. You know what? That was no accident. He's mine. Stay away from me. Oh, 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 girls, peace and love. Oh, Come so on. No guys are fighting over this. Yeah, right. Fight about it. John Tucker's ah. mine. Oh. Oh. I'm dating John Tucker. Oh, no. <laughs> In a way, this would happen. I do know a, a person talking to multiple people. They go to the same school or like, in a way, they, they are all connected, but they don't know. Even though in the clip it shows how the girls automatically went to fighting, nowadays in high school, students go straight to social media and like Snapchat. They definitely sub other girls. And that's what leads to even physical altercation. Cool Asians, varsity jocks, unfriendly black hotties, girls who eat their feelings, 
girls who don't need anything, desperate wannabes, burnouts, sexually active band geeks, the greatest people you will ever meet, and the worst. In Spelman, the seating arrangements is like seniors sit with seniors, juniors sit with juniors, like the freshmen sit with freshmen. There might be some tables where it's like a little mix. In the clip, it's definitely not how it is, how the athletes sit with the athletes. That's definitely changed. For my school, it's just, everybody's more unified. Like, yeah. no one's like breaking up into separate groups. Mostly they, they all hang out together. Beaver, Pierce Legitimate, computer organizer, recording device. I can't grab those balls. Pierce Legitimate. This is a projectile launcher. That's a weapon. For my school, we don't have metal detectors. Say if there's like an incident that happens, days later they'll have like a surprise security checkup. So they will bring in metal detectors for the day. And like some people get caught with like things that they shouldn't have. It is now 7.06. You have exactly eight hours and 54 minutes to think about why you're here. To ponder the error of your ways. And you may not talk. You will not move from these seats. From my school, we definitely don't have detention on the weekends. Oh, and they're definitely not eight hours long. Mm -hmm. For detention, like, they will have us in there for like at least 45 minutes. You have to sit there and like do your homework mm -hmm. and you can't talk. All right, people, we're gonna try something a little different today. We are going to write an essay. And instead of doing the whole essay thing, our dean makes us do SAT practice. So PSAT work. I would have to say the scene is a pretty good depiction of how detention is now in high school. These films are definitely exaggerated on how like high school is in real life. But at the same time, it's a good thing because if people want to watch a movie, they don't want to see like the same thing that happens to them like in real life. We don't want to see an exact representation of how the high school life is. When we watch like High School Musical, a lot of kids were like, oh my gosh, I wonder if this is how high school yeah. is going to be. We go to high school, it's not the same, but we still enjoy watching movies like that. Like it's just our fantasies. Like, yeah. Why can't we just all sing in the cafeteria together? Yeah. <laughs>